compete defensively a little bit more if he knows he got a couple of good good touches from the offensive end. Golden State winning those previous two meetings that I mentioned, including one here in late November. Morris is shot no good, but it's guided home. Let's, let's come up with all different types of game plans just to uh, get wins. It's a lot more pressure on the coaching staff. Zubats the quick kick. Morris for a corner three. He understands he's on a winning team, so things are going to be done differently here, and he's going to be better because of it. Morris able to find the spot and beat the shot clock buzzer. So big on the bench getting a little breather here. Marcus Morris has had the hot hand. A little bit short that time with a rebound corralled weak side by Poole. Their value and their talent level when you can piecemeal things in a season like this like they're having. And, and I think one of the things that happens, oh, nice up and under right there by Marcus Morris. And how about this shooting star by Golden State? 7 of 11 from deep. And Golden State's come out of this timeout and gone to his own trying to... Trying to slow the Clippers down, but whether it's zone, man, it doesn't matter. Triangle and two, box and one. And Steve Kerr now starts to go deeper into his bench. This is Jordan Poole. Ty Lue and the Clippers, 27 straight game without Paul George. And right now having some defensive issues. Eight straight points. Morris open. Good look at it. Now the Warriors can hold for the last shot. Spiro Dietz, Brendan Haywood, Dennis Scott, rest of our NBA TV crew. There's Marcus Morris, finds his spot, and hits. One of the best bigs on the court. Go out there and make your impact felt in the paint. This is Morris, steps into a three, well challenged by Kuminga. And, and Zubak knows who he is. He understands where to be, where to go, when it's time for him to shoot the ball, and when it's time for him to pass. And right there is a great take, that great take to the rim as Clay misses an easy three for him. And it's only their first three, but they have been really good from the mid-range as Looney is fouled. More on the defensive side. And I think we're seeing that again for Golden State. He's inserted Gary Payton here, one of his better defenders off the bench. About to play in his first All-Star game as a starter on Sunday night in Cleveland. Morris gets it back and hits. We're now seeing that a guy like Ty Lue is an incredible coach. And he can win with any style, any lineup, and he's not afraid to mix it up and try new things on the fly. You know, people said some of the same, same things about Steve Kerr when they have those, had those incredible teams. And then the two years that they really struggled is Curry. Hello. Bangs in a three. Four-point play coming and up. And he's fouled. Well, when they get close to the postseason and when they get Draymond back and they get Wiseman back, Obviously, there's going to be some people that are going to be short on minutes. And, you know, you get, you play, in the playoffs, you're normally playing about the, your top eight guys.